To build the thermistor LED circuit, you're going to need two LEDs. Uh, make sure that they're two different ones. You're going to need a thermistor and a resistor. That's uh, 10 kilo ohms. And you're going to need five jumper cables. Okay, so first, I'm going to go ahead and connect the thermistor from the positive to the breadboard there you go and then we're going to connect the resistor from the negative to the breadboard and you have to make sure that it, it is in line with the thermistor. There you go. And then we can connect the 5 volt. You can see that's the 5 volt source to the positive. And we can connect ground to the negative here. Next, we'll connect the LED. Make sure that you do the long leg to the positive. And then we'll connect the green LED. Also, the long leg being this one to the positive. There you go. And then the code, it should be. The way that I have it is 8 for the red one, which you connect on the breadboard here. So that's the red one connected, and then the green one will be on the 9. So we'll connect it in the same way we connected the Red LED, you can see it's in line with their respective LEDs. Then finally, we connect the A0 so that it measures the same point between the thermistor and the resistor. So, this will be the voltage out. And we can connect the power source. So here we can see the green light is on, which in the code, it's uh, converting the voltage value from the voltage out to resistance, and then from resistance to temperature in Kelvin, and then from Kelvin it's converting to both Celsius and Fahrenheit. In the code I have it so that if it's less than 85 degrees Fahrenheit, the green and then if we heat up the thermistor it'll be greater than 85 degrees or equal to and it'll turn red so going over the circuit once again the power comes from the 5 volt to the positive where it goes to the thermistor and then to the voltage out which takes the information to the Arduino and then through the resistor to the ground. Then we have the digital ports 8 and 9 which are controlled by the Arduino. The, they are both powered by the 5 volt but the Arduino controls when it's on depending on how much temperature the thermistor is uh, collecting. 
There you go. So it's less than 85 degrees. Then it's equal to or greater than 85 degrees.